Want to use icons like me and elaborate your experience on EFC 24? Well, check out U7 Buy. It's the only place JD Gaming ever uses to buy his FC coins. Type in JD for a cheeky 6% off. Link in the description. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the video. Today we look at Lothar Mateus. High, high work rates, 5 foot 9, 4 star weak foot with the 3 star skills. This car looks absolutely sensational. When you look at his stats, they're insane across the board whether that's his pace shooting long shots and shot power is insane as well as having the shot power plus play style which is a very very important play style i'll tell you what if there is any kind of trend with the best cards i've used in this game they've all got this power shot plus play style i think it's a very 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 good play style to have and even though you probably haven't inculcated or installed this version in your playstyle make sure you do if you got somebody who's got the power shot plus playstyle you need to start utilizing it because i tell you what goalkeepers don't know what dare is they can't stop it it's just going flying at the back of the net it this is such an overpowered mechanic in this game you can see the goalkeeper's diving but the ball's already at the back of the net this card it has got insane long shots and shot power. Even if you don't use his incredible playstyle of shot power, he's still got insane shot power regardless of that playstyle. He scored me so many goals like that. He just runs into the box and then he just shoots using that playstyle and gets the ball at the back of the net. It was a recurring trend of Lothar Mateus. So his shooting is insane. His pace absolutely brilliant his tackling is some of the best in the game i tell you what after Vieira, this is the best cdm i've ever used in this game period there's no doubt about it Vieira first and this guy i tell you one thing about him right i tell you one thing about lothar matthias he's literally everywhere now i don't like high high work rates personally for a cdm but this guy he deserves him why because he can shoot he can defend he can do it all there's only one thing this car doesn't do that well, and that's dribble. He can dribble, don't get me wrong. I think it's wrong for me to say he's not a good dribbler. His dribbling is the only thing that is not sticking out. I mean, if you look at his pace, insane. Shooting, insane. Passing, insane. Defending, insane. Physicality, insane. Stamina, insane. And then you look at his dribbling, and he's slightly underwhelming. And that's my point. I mean, it, on another card, his dribbling is good. But on this card... Because of the other stats are so, so good, it just leaves a bit of a hole in what this guy can do. Now, he did get tackled a few times when I was trying to run forward with him, but he can dribble. And there was occasions where his lovely dribbling, you know, uh, eventually when I got it. I think you got to all one dribble with this guy because his natural dribbling isn't very good. Maybe you could rectify and ratify that using the... Chem the engine chemistry style maybe that'd be a good option for you guys to utilize however this is a really good card he does so much right he in my opinion if i were to go to like if i were to play competitive fifa or efc 24 if i were to play competitively of course i'm not competitive about this game my highest my highest foot champs finish is rank three and i don't really care about getting higher i really don't care about this game i'll be honest with you guys my job is simple to review look at that pass right there insane so he's passing pace defending stamina just just everything about this card is just insane i wish he had four star skills that would have given a little bit more option for him going forward and the dribbling but look he doesn't have the best dribbling, neither does he have skills, but that does not remove the fact that this is an elite level CDM centre mid in this game. You don't need to have the best dribbling as a centre mid. You don't need to have four star skills as a centre mid, okay? Let's not try to fit every single attribute to this guy, but what he does is insane. He cuts out play, he defends really well, he goes up, he scores goals. This is an S tier icon. Without a shadow of a doubt. I prefer him more than Rude Hullet. I have no idea why Rude Hullet. I don't know what Rude Hullet's price is by the way. But he might be a million and a half coins more than him. And I tell you what. I don't understand why. I, I do genuinely think. I know this is a bit stupid here. But I do think that Lothar Mateus is a very underrated icon. 
in not just this FIFA, in every FIFA that I've ever played. People just don't look at this guy as uh, one of the best. He absolutely is one of the best centre mids and always has been. Lothar Mateus is an insane centre mid CDM. I love him, always have. This is a fantastic card. I wouldn't think twice. Cop him now. He will make a big difference in your ultimate team. Thank you.